We're in the city of San Diego on Del Mar Mesa Preserve, driving to an area of core biological habitat. This land was set, actually set aside to preserve the habitat. So through our natural resource management plan, we've been determining should we allow trails in certain areas or not. In that process, we've invited the San Diego tracking team to come out and look at areas that we were determining should we prevent that, should we close the access, or leave it open. Well, the San Diego tracking team is a group of volunteers that have um, studied tracking and um, using their uh, tracking skills, they're able to go out on a quarterly basis and um, do surveys in various open space areas uh, throughout the county now and gather data about uh, what's happening in those areas. Uh, it's presence of various species that are good indicators of the health of those habitat areas. So based on the data that we had received from San Diego Tracking Team, another way we use that is to determine where should we place cameras from a consultant so we could confirm whether or not the wildlife were using those, these corridors. So we took that information at this space, this area, which is an intersection of, of two unapproved trails. We placed the camera and we got confirmation. In fact, animals are using this as a corridor. Every morning there was a deer, a coyote, and then a bobcat in the pictures. And then in the evening, a deer, a coyote, and a bobcat. It just confirmed we had made the right decision that this space in this preserve should be a core biological area where we wouldn't have public access, providing the animals an opportunity to live their lives without interference from human beings. Did you find something? Uh, sure, there are a lot of bobcats. Mm -hmm. Oh, cool. All over the place. Wow. Do you want to start with the bobcat or do you want to stop? Yeah, let's start with the bobcat. We can find a really clear... Uh, well, today we're doing a uh, tracker training at the uh, Shaw Lopez Ridge uh, Wildlife Tunnel. And it's situated within the uh, city of San Diego open space between uh, Lopez Canyon Preserve uh, and the Panisquitos Canyon uh, Preserve areas. Well, the function of li wildlife corridor is to facilitate uh, animal movement between core areas. And by facilitating that movement, you get genetic uh, interchange between the core areas. And um, that helps maintain healthy core habitat areas. So here you can see tracks of deer. I mean, based on the way the toes are pointing, the deer was walking in that direction, right here. We are so fortunate in the city of San Diego to have over 27,000 acres of preserved open space that we can come visit the home of the wildlife. And we have to remember that when we come to these open space areas, we're the visitor in their home. And so we want to respect their home and their spaces by staying on the trails. And you can really have the opportunity to maybe see some of those animals if you're observant. And if you really want to get involved, you can join the San Diego tracking team and learn to identify what you're looking at on the trails and around you, which would really enhance your experience as you visit our San Diego open spaces. Mm -hmm.